The 95th Bundesliga Rhein Derby between Gladbach and Köln at the Borussia Park. Gladbach having lost their three most recent confrontations with their arch rivals. Daniel Farke, after recovering from Covid, saw his team take the lead in the 27th minute. The fall's first aerial goal of the season, although technically off the shoulder of Marvin Friedrich. His first Bundesliga goal for Borussia Mönchengladbach after a Jonas Hoffmann corner. Four minutes later, an on-pitch review determined that there had been a foul inside the box by Holtmann on Florian Kainz. A penalty to Kern, which was slotted home very calmly by the Austrian himself. One goal apiece. And those same two players were involved again at the opposite end right on half-time. This time a Kainz elbow on Holtmann. A second yellow card for Kainz as well as a penalty award. And Rami Bensebaini, 100% from the spot in the Bundesliga, kept his record going in style. Just what the doctor ordered for Borussia Mönchengladbach after the 5-1 thumping in Bremen last week. 2-1 at half-time on a stunning autumn day in the Niederrhein region. And the third Gladbach goal, two minutes into the second half, was nothing if not stunning. Gladbach's press discovered in Köln. And there was Lars Stindl to provide an instant classic derby moment. One that will be played back by Gladbach fans for years to come. Köln were to suffer again when Ben Sabaini netted his second of the game and his fourth of the season. But Stefan Baumgart's side did pull one back in the 83rd minute through substitute Dennis Hussein Bazic, beating Stefan Leiner to a bouncing ball. But Gladbach had the final say. Marcus Turan with a classy finish right at the end, teed up by Alassane Plea. Emphatic football from Borussia Mönchengladbach, who have now won 52 of the 95 Rhein derbies played in Bundesliga history.